The most prestigious award is conferred upon the organization that demonstrates exceptional practices, primarily in the HR or transformation divisions of the company. Those in contention must demonstrate processes, policies, and procedures that ensure the employment of women, increase skills development, and provide a clear path for advancement. Now let's hear from Andrew Harris, who's the marketing director from Bosch and Dahl Wines. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. For over 335 years, Bosch and Dahl has supported and celebrated both powerful and successful women, starting with our very own Susan Delanoy, who was one of our founders in 1685. Up until today, Bosch and Dahl has been known for, for its precise and high quality wine range that is distributed around the world. Most recently, we won the award for best in class in the museum class at the Amarim Cup Classique for our Jean de Lange, which spends more than nine years on the lease. Just two years ago, our very own Cup Classique and white winemaker, Danielle Kutsia, was, was named Woman Winemaker of the Year. And so it is with great pride that Bosch and Dahl is proud to present the top woman business of the year. And let's look at those finalists. The companies are Vodacom, Unilever, Ituba Holdings, Institute of Directors South Africa, Dagu Group, and Mdito Enterprise Solutions. And in third place is Unilever, with second place coming Vodacom. And now, the winner of this category is Congratulations to the Institute of Directors, South Africa. I look forward to sharing many glasses of Bosch and Dahl Cup Classique in the near future. The Institute of Directors in South Africa advocates and influences transformation and diversity on boards in SA. The IOD SA also focuses heavily on gender empowerment within the organization and indeed the proof is in the pudding, or rather the numbers in this case. 63% of IOD SA board members are women. 100% of IOD SA executive management are women. 72% of staff bursaries for 2020 went to women. 50% of management development program for 2020 went to women. And 75% of all promotions in 2020 went to women. Ladies and gentlemen, the Institute of Directors South Africa Congratulations. So that's so awesome. Um, Institute of Directors in South Africa. And uh, not too sure who's actually accepting the award. Good evening. And congratulations to you. Please introduce yourself. To Hello, us. Acceptor. Thank you so much. Uh, my name is Palmy Natterson, and I'm the Chief Executive ah. Officer of the Institute of Directors in South Africa. It gives me really great pleasure to accept this award on behalf of the IODSA. We believe in gender empowerment not only in our own business but also using our voice and influence to advocate for gender empowerment in business in general in South Africa and specifically on boards, because we believe it just makes business sense. Receiving this award just makes our voice so much louder and we thank you so much.